In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to use GIMP to make wire art, like you see here. So let's start by creating a new project. So go to File, New, and I'm using an image file of 640 by 400 pixels. And the first thing that we need to do is to add an alpha channel to this layer, because we want to make part of this transparent. So right click on the layer, and then select Add Alpha Channel. And then next, select the Ellipse Select tool, this button right here. And then we're going to select a large ellipse area, just like this. And then next, fill it in with a black color. So choose the Bucket Fill tool. Make sure that the foreground color is set to black, and then click. And next, we want to remove this white background. So go up to the Select menu and click on Invert, and that will invert the selection. So now the white area is selected. And then press the Delete key on your keyboard. And now invert the selection again. So now we have this black area selected. And next we're going to shrink the selection. So go up to the Select menu and choose Shrink. And we want to shrink it by 5 pixels. So set this to 5 and then press OK. And now back here on our ellipse, hit the Delete key on your keyboard again. And now with this area still selected, we're going to add a grid. So go up to the Filters menu, select Render, Pattern, and Grid. And set the width for the horizontal and vertical lines to 2. And then you can leave the other values as default and press OK. And next we're going to add some text. So click on the text tool and I'm going to use a font of sans bold and then set the size to 180 pixels. And then type in your text. And then you can select the move tool to position it. And next we want to select the outline of the text. So go over to the text layer, right click, and select Alpha to Selection. And then we want to shrink this selection. So go to the Select menu and select Shrink. And we'll shrink this again by 5 pixels. And then next, combine these two layers. And we do that while the top layer is selected. Right click on it and select Merge Down. And then we'll delete the inside area of this text just by pressing the Delete key on the keyboard. And then remove the selection by going to Select and choose None. And now we're ready to give this the appearance of wire. So go up to the Filters menu and select Alpha to Logo and then select Chrome and then press OK. And this gives us our final image. And now you can go over to the top layer, right click, and select Merge Down to combine these top two layers. And now you have the top layer, which is the wire art, and a separate background layer. So you can then change this background layer to anything you like. Well that concludes this video. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and leave a comment.